Hey pretty gang, it is Jen, your exclusive start of business coach. This video is brought to you by my Braid Hair for Cash course. Go in the description, check it out. So I actually want to come in and talk to you guys about a couple of services or a couple of things that you can add to your braiding business and add it to your price list of things that you are willing to do and things that some clients may be interested in, okay? So the first thing that you can add to your things that you do is touch-ups, right? So a touch-up might be where somebody has gotten two layers, but you do their top layer over, right? Or say, for example, somebody came to you and they got individuals, and some people might just want you to do the front over, the sides, and the back. So that's something that you can offer extra or additional is touch-ups. The next thing that you can offer for those of you guys who know how to twist dreads, like for example, I don't know how to start dreads, but I know how to tighten and retwist dreads, right? So that's something that you can offer is a retwist, right? And a retwist is usually the whole entire hand. You're just retwisting or relocking the dreads. Um, the next thing that you can also offer is um, lessons. You can offer lessons, you guys. If you are good at teaching people hand, um, hands on and one on one, you definitely can um, do classes or courses where you teach people one on one, or you can do a course online where you give lessons. Um, to show somebody maybe how to braid their own hair, how to do other people's hair, you can definitely do lessons. Um, also, you guys, there are people who get a lot of wigs installed or they're about to go get their, um, their weave installed. So something that you can possibly offer is maybe beehives. I know that was something I used to offer is beehives. And you can also offer if they need it for you to do the beehive as well as to sew on um, a wig cap and or a wig net. That's something else that you can offer. And the last thing that you can offer you guys, which many of us know about, is a wash and a um, blow dry. For many of us, um, depending on your state, many of us, I don't think you have to have, um, or I know in the state of California, um, you know, blow drying and washing hair is not um, a part of any type of cosmetology school. I mean, I'm sure you there in certain salons there are shampoo girls but um for those of us who are doing you know online not said online business for those of you guys oh those of us who are doing braiding business and we're the majority getting our money you know like kind of under the table i'm sure people wouldn't be against you washing and blow drying their hair so that's something additional that you can do if it's okay with your state and or your city so you guys i hope this was helpful and i'll be talking to you guys later bye y'all